Hi everybody, Brian here from QuantLabs.net. Okay, in this video, September 30th, 8.38 uh, a.m., I'm going to go over uh, a, qu a query, a Q&A video I've not done in a while. Um, this is a pretty good one. Uh, probably a lot of people fall into this, so let's get into this. Alrighty, um, opens up with, I have been uh, already trading for many years, but mainly CFD futures, and I usually trade only automatically or semi-automatically on MT4, MetaTrader 4 platform. I always got to get these transitions right, my apologies. So, semi-automatically on MT4 platform, actually writing good system for more exciting for me to make, more exciting for me than to make money. So this is a serious person, obviously, a lot of experience. Recently, I've gone through uh, serious studies to, M to ML, in ML, I'm thinking that's machine learning, and of course, uh, Python. So I have now, uh, I have now, of course, my head full of ideas how to implement ML into trading. I'm actually going to go over that with, with a new Python package somebody um, got me somewhat turned on to, but again, time is never on my side, but I'll get that in a minute. Another video, it's called, uh, just so you know, it's called F-I-N-R-L. we we'll just do that. F-I-N, reinforcement learning, fin rl So I'll, I'll talk about that in another video. It's hard to switch from MQL. This is the programming language for MetaTrader 4 and well-known MT4 platform to something totally unknown. But I'd like to find a platform and a reliable broker where I could trade via an API. The broker would need to offer some instruments which I usually trade, DAX 40, FTSE uh, 100, DJ, Dow Jones, and other indices. Okay, let's stop right there. Um, so he's talking about another platform. And um, hopefully you know about my uh, thoughts on MotoWave at MotoWave.com. These are the connections or the different brokers you can get access to. So I don't know what broker you have. You have AMP. These are the popular futures brokers, Dorman, um, and whatever else. On top of that, they also talk to a lot of the <coughs> popular <coughs> Forex brokers, be it Forex.com, FXCM, Gain, Oanda, and so on. Okay. Um, you can see your stage five optimist for futures again. So there's that. And on top of that, which I loved about uh, in the early days when I came across MotorWave was um, they started actually um, listing to myself and, and trying to figure out what brokers would be good for crypto. So now they've added Coinbase Pro, Kraken, which I'm using. Um, I believe they had another one. Um, but uh, you have Binance as well. Um, Canon's really good for options and futures. They also include interactive brokers. So they cover everything. So there's no um, excuses there not to be able to make the switch. The other thing here, uh, that this, and, and this could, as I said, this could be applied to a lot of people. Um, being able to use a reliable platform via an API. Now, the switch here is it's Python using the software development kit of MotorWave, okay? So to make that transition is gonna to be tough at the beginning, but I've read on the forum that many, many people have made that transition from namely MetaTrader, broken out all the shackles, and being able to really um, blow up their uh, opportunities in uh, in another platform like MotorWave. So again, um, here's if on my channel, at Quant Labs, so this is youtube.com uh, slash Quant Labs. In here I've got a variety of channels, or sorry, playlists. You have MotorWave here. Um, so I've got, I think, 150 plus videos there if you want to learn about MotorWave and my thoughts on it. Namely, also, um, just because I talk a lot about crypto um, doesn't mean I don't cover other asset classes, which I do. The problem is I have I find with anything related around MT4, MetaTrader 4, usually it's tied to a cor corrupt uh, Forex broker. Um, and they're heavily regulated. So it limits your ability to make real money as compared to crypto. And with Oanda, um, 
namely, I do cover a lot of the um, a lot of the different uh, instruments in there. What's moving, what's not moving. But I always come back to crypto actually, actually to say uh, but why it doesn't pay the bills. Why this is moving and why that's moving. Okay, so again, there's a lot of videos in here uh, in 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 uh, the Zoanda. A playlist so you could go through that and as well as I said I've got the one for motive wave as well so going back to his uh, uh, questions here um, I'm looking for somebody who could give me a short intro into Python tools for trading I've got a whole course on that um, at my shop quantlabs.net slash shop I have noticed you have already a webinar for Python and crypto but I'd rather be more interested in traditional instruments which I already know. I already covered in my Python course Forex, namely for OANDA. Um, but again, um, you could do the same thing with FXCM uh, as well. But again, I'm not going to sit here and say the same thing. But as I said earlier, when you deal with an MQL or MT4, the platform, usually it's tied to a corrupt broker. Hint, hint. Okay. And, uh, it's very tough to trade in those kind of environments. They, they have so many limitations that they don't give you in crypto. And I can also say the same thing about the futures market as well. Plus you also have the limiting uh, factor of margin requirement as well. So that is another big factor. I just don't do futures because it just holds you back and you can get crazy returns without the crazy leverage as well uh, if, if you don't have something that works. So hopefully that will answer all these paragraphs here. So do you have something like the webinar for crypto more related to FX and CFD? I do. Um, I've got other stuff I used to do in Oanda, um, Duca's copy, but I've kind of moved off of that. It's just it's really dated and, and, and it's a shrinking. Um, uh, for, these companies are shrinking because of crypto. Because crypto is taking over, uh, look at Coinbase. They're stock, uh, stock listed now, um, so that you don't find any forex brokers that are listed in the stock market. So that's the difference as well. I, I'm, I do have, I do not have much time to go through the full learning process just from zero and discover anything on my own. Just need some guide. Like, well, that's kind of like what I'm uh, trans transitioning towards. Uh, if you followed my. Um, topic on Monday night, my usual weekly webinar, is exactly that. There are going to be limitations with Python, namely on the execution and automation orders. So I've got all of the tools that I need now over the last few, few years to help suss out trading opportunities with crypto. And they're really good um, opportunities for crypto, um, namely for primarily Kraken, but I'm going to do repeat the same thing for a select number of Coinbase. I've kind of gone over that as well in, in my previous video, or will have a previous video on that. Um, also, if you move over to MotoWave, I put out a video uh, here to cut down the time, okay? Because a lot of people, including myself, don't have the time, okay? So if you look at a video called which are the best indicators for algo trading? So those are specifically for uh, for MotorWave. And there's really only two that I come away with. There's over 200 plus. And the easiest ones that work are, um, so again, video playlist, uh, but this one just look for what are the best indicators for algo trading. So as I said, um, what you wanna look for are what studies really work. Um, so the only two that I've come across are one called Reverse MACD, which is probably the absolute best one. There's another one called MAMA. Um, and there's, there's a new one called a Swing Points in there as well. So you, you could try those out um, and download a trial version of MotorWave, play with it, see if it's to your liking, and just focus on those to make life simple. But there's so much you can build on on top of with MotorWave, okay? So again, with MotorWave, you just, just download a trial edition of MotorWave, and um, there's, there's a community edition as well, which is free. So um, there's your free trial right there, okay? 
So try that out. The, 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 it's probably the right path. And just follow what I'm doing um, with uh, the coin setups the, and all that because I'm more active again on YouTube since YouTube allows me to talk about crypto again without not being getting any effects on my monetization. I'm not being getting any effects on on my um, crypto talk. But hey, I'm shadow banned on YouTube, but it's still better to be on here than other platforms from what I'm seeing. So we'll leave it at that. Um, Hopefully this will answer this uh, person's questions. Uh, and I'm sure a lot of people can relate to this. So hopefully um, just to cut down all the BS that's out there and um, being able to use a really rock solid platform, go through the forum as well at, uh, at MotoWave. Um, I think what you'll have here is you'll, you'll experience, or you'll find other people explaining the same thing where they come from platforms like MetaTrader or Forex Trading move into Moto Wave and they just found it's just a, it, it is a big transition but a lot of them will stay because it, it's a very very feature rich platform and it, it's 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 just you can build off it and you can do a lot of powerful things with it um, and hopefully my stuff has um, will help cut down all those uh, BS. Even my own stuff over the last 10 plus years, I'm not going to lie to you, it is overwhelming. So hopefully it'll help you out. Now, if you're new to all the stuff that I do, obviously I've just shown you my YouTube channel. Um, two things you can look at is if you go to quantlabs.net under uh, contact, right up here, quantlabs.net, uh, okay, you go into contact, that will enable you to join our newsletter um, and on top of that you can also uh, try out our free chat server and there's no tracking there's no logging of any of what you do <clears throat> and um, mostly it's right now is really quiet I don't know why but people do log in read my own private research and stuff that I post uh, quite a bit here and you can reach out to me here on this uh, chat server because I'm trying to get off of Facebook and YouTube and all that and move everything into a private um, environment where there's no logging and tracking, as I said, where, you know, even Telegram and Signal and all that has its problems as well. But here, you just need uh, to log in. That's it. And we'll leave it at that, okay? And um, hopefully you f you'll find that useful. And uh, we shall talk to you later. Have a good day.